Let us try if this will work. It's working. Again, working. Okay, na? okay, this time I am going to show you on how to do the simple circuit. Before we start, please make sure that the power source is off. We will be needing the following. We have here the lamp holder, our lamp, and the switch. I already put also the wires. Two wires for our lamp, two wires for our source, and two wires for our switch. Okay, let's put first the switch. I have shown you in the previous video that we have to measure the stripping length of the wire. So after measuring, we can now remove the insulation of the wire. After removing the insulation of the wire, insert it into the switch. We have to make sure that the wires are fully inserted. We're going to fix this later on. Now let us proceed with our lamp receptacle. With our lamp receptacle, so again we have to remove the insulation of the wire. Okay, so the wire should be not too long. So Again, we have to cut the excess wire. As I have mentioned, it should not be too long. So if there is any excess, because there should be no exposed wire to prevent shortage. If we are sure of the length of the wire, we have to screw it properly. So we have to secure the wires. Make sure that the wires are fully inserted into our lamp holder terminals. To test if the wires are fully inserted, so we are going to pull the wires because loose connection tends to make our lamp flicker so we are going to connect first the wire from our lamp and one wire from our switch so we have to remove the insulation at least two to five centimeters It should be not too short because if we tend to, if we remove a very short insulation, so it tend to remove. So after twisting the wire, we can bend it to so that there would be no loose connection so the other wire from our lamp holder will be connected with with our source
So I remove the copper copper insulation and twist the wire again. So make sure that the wires are fully connected and secured. And another line from our source and another line from the switch. So again, reminders when doing this, please make sure that the source is already terminated or it is already turned off. Okay. So after this, we are going to okay, secure the lamp holder. We also have to check if there is any uh, shorted from our installation. So put the selector switch into resistance. As you can see, the our needle does not move, meaning so our connection is good. Because if it moves, there is shorted. So now we can secure our connections with electric tape. So in putting electric tape, it should be tight enough. So the the thickness of the electric tape should be the same with the thickness of our insulation. So we just we're just going to fix the wire inside and later on we are going to test our simple circuit. Okay, so we we are here to test. Turn on the circuit breaker. Switch. Ta-da! Success. So now we have our simple circuit.